Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys some of my most recent beauty favorites. Some of these products I've been using for like ever, and some of these I just started using, but I just wanted to show you guys because I'm literally obsessed. Okay, so the first product is this Airbrush Flawless Foundation that I'm sure you guys have been hearing so much about. It's seriously just like the best foundation I've ever used. I've been using the same foundation for years, which was honestly just a drugstore Maybelline. It's right here. It was the Superstay Maybelline Foundation. I've been using it for years and I loved it and I just couldn't find anything else I liked. So then I finally got convinced on trying this from like a lot of people and just like from TikTok and it's so good. I love it. It literally does look like you have like like your skin is airbrushed and you only need a little bit of this product. So speaking of Charlotte Tilbury, since we're still on that subject. So I was at Sephora buying that foundation and this, the girl there was like, you need to try this Hollywood flawless filter. And sorry guys. So I was like, I don't really care so much for it. Like I don't, you know, I've heard about it, but I didn't really like, I wasn't really excited to just try it. So I got the mini version of it. And I don't know if you guys know, but there is a dupe for it, and it's the Maybelline 4-in-1 Protector. Obviously, you can see it's, like, almost done. So, this is the original, and this is the dupe. So, honestly, you guys, I'm obsessed with this. Literally obsessed. I'm not just saying this. I like this a lot more than this. I know it's... They're totally different products and I know, you know, obviously this is more like high-end and this is drugstore, but you know, people do say it's a dupe. I can understand why people say it's a dupe, but you guys, this is just like it. If you guys like this and you don't really like want to keep spending money on this, um, which I got the mini version that was like $15, I would get this. So it's a Maybelline Perfector 4-in-1. It's a primer, concealer, highlighter, BB cream, all in one. Guys, I feel like I don't have my clip on the right way. I feel like it looks kind of weird, does it? I'm like obsessed with these, by the way. Um, got them off Amazon. There was so many on this. I had like so many of them and I just keep using them. I just feel like they're just like cute and girly. This is the next product and this is the Dior blush that I'm sure you guys have heard of. It went so viral after somebody said that Kylie's makeup artist like uses this on her and then i think he came out saying like he doesn't use it but it went viral because of how freaking cute it is so i went to the mall to actually buy it and they were like oh it's out of stock it's been sold out ever since it went viral so i kept checking on like the dior website for it and it finally was in stock so i got it right away i absolutely love it it's so cute i'm like i'm a blush person um so this is definitely like it's just so pretty look at the color it's such a pretty pink. It doesn't really look like this on the skin though. I don't know how to explain it. It just like, I feel like it looks different on everybody, but it's really cute. So this is literally probably the only blush I'm going to be using. I don't have it on today. Um, like I said earlier, I have like such a blah makeup look today, but this, I kind of can't live without it anymore. So the next thing is kind of weird, but um, I'm kind of obsessed. So this is actually for babies. It's by um, Pipet. I still don't know how to say this brand. Pipet. Whatever. This is this is the brand name. So this is a balm stick that um, I bought for my son just to use if he has like any you know chappy skin or whatever in the cold. And then I saw like what it was doing to his cheeks. <laughs> like it was just really hydrated and just so nice. So I was like okay i'm gonna steal this and use it for me and i i've been using this on my so i literally stole it from him and i've been using this on my lips for chapstick and you guys it is so good i have the most chapped lips ever like i don't think anyone has more chapped lips than i do you guys it's so nice it's so good it feels so good on the lips it doesn't feel like it's just and it lasts and your lips and I literally will take it and put it on my lips and then like smother it around like around my lips just so it can look like hydrated and fresh and it's so good. I'm literally never going to stop buying this. Like I seriously swear by it. You guys have to get it. 
It's the Balm Stick by Pipette. Can you guys see it? Is it focused? Okay, so the next thing is actually skincare. So this is by Is Clinical. If you guys can see. So I got this small one to see. Is this blurry? Okay. So I got this small one to see if I like it, and I'm getting the bigger one. Um, so this is a cleansing complex. It's a face wash, and you guys, I love it. I haven't used any like medical grade. He's so busy, I don't know what he's doing. I promise you guys, I keep opening the door for him and he's just like not getting out. So I wasn't using any like medical grade um, skincare when obviously when I was pregnant and in the beginning of my pregnancy when I was breastfeeding, I just didn't want to use anything. So now that I'm like back on my skincare routine, need to get my skin right, I got this and I love it. This is such a good skin, like a face wash. And I know the difference between good and bad face wash. This, this melts off my makeup. And like, you know those face, face washes that just feel like like you, you could put so much on, but you're like, you can tell it's not washing your face. Like, um, there's this one by, oh, the Cora. I think it's called Cora, the face wash. I have that. You guys, I can pump out the whole thing in my hand and try to wash my face and nothing comes off. I feel like literally it doesn't do thing, like anything for my skin. So if you guys do want to try this, my sister who is also an esthetician actually sells this. So if you guys want to try it, I can, I'm going to link her Instagram in my bio and I'll put like this clinical um, complex, uh, cleansing complex face wash and you guys can contact her and she'll get it for you guys. I don't know how to use these clips. I like them, but I don't know how to use them. Oh, oh. So the next thing is this Makeup by Mario eyeshadow palette. So the reason why I love this is because it has all the colors you need. So the reason, the way he created this, which I actually just found out, is like it's like for skin tones, like different color skin tones. And it just, um, it's like perfect for just giving your eye just like a contour. And that's a thing, you guys, if you don't like to wear eyeshadow, I don't really care for eyeshadow, but sometimes I'll just take, sometimes I'll just take, um, this is actually his brush too, which is so good, so, so good. I'll just take like a light color. I always like to like match like my bronzer and like my nose contour. So I'll just take like a, like a nude, like neutral color and then, I just kind of like give my eye like some color and then I'll just go up. I don't know if you guys know that but like when you guys go up on your eyeshadow, it gives you more of like a cat eye, like stretched out cat eye look. You can do so many looks with this palette too, like just smoky eye, neutral, just anything. I feel like I have so many eyeshadow palettes, you guys like a lot, like a drawer build. I don't use them, they're all put away. And this is the only one I have here on my makeup station. This is the only one I use for any event. The next product um, is not new. I feel like it's popular all the time. But I just kind of started like recently using it. And I really like it. I never liked primer. I think I've talked in my last couple videos about how I really don't care for makeup primer. But I love this one. It's the e.l.f putty primer and I get the luminous one because I just like the luminous look and I really like it you guys I love the way it feels on the skin the texture the way it looks after I really feel like it like blocks my pores makes my skin so smooth and I notice a really big difference now of how it makes my like foundation look so I really like this and it's so inexpensive for a primer and it's so good so if you guys are looking for um, primer don't go get yourself like a crazy expensive one because I'm just not crazy about primers like and I just I don't know this is like the one I actually really love if I'm like always going to be using one this is the only one that I like so elf putty primer I'm on my last step I'm just showing them one more thing Dad. Hey, mommy, what are you doing? I'm, trying to, I'm trying to do something so the last thing I wanted to show you guys that I've been loving is my new favorite lip combo. 
It's the NYX lip liner in cold brew. And I, um, so I put that, I don't have that on right now. I feel like I should have had the things on that I liked, huh? I should have done that. Um, but it's okay. I can do, if you guys are interested, I can do like a video just showing you guys how all these things look to show you guys if you guys do want to buy them or not. So it's a cold brew lip liner. So I put that all around my lips, obviously outline my lips, and then I take it a little like in the, on the sides. And then I go over, uh, I don't wear a lipstick, and then I go over it with the, this is the Maybelline Lifter Gloss. It's a dupe for something, I forgot what it's a dupe for. Maybe the Dior Gloss that everyone uses? I, I have to figure out what it is, but it's a dupe for something. I didn't actually know that until after I bought it and then I was seeing it all over social media that was like such a good dupe. But um, it's so good. So it, it has hyaluronic acid in there actually. So really hydrating. And I just love this color. It's so cute. So this one is the Lifter Maybelline Lifter Gloss in Moon. So it's 003 Moon. So these two together are such a cute combo. This has been honestly like my everyday lip combination. I don't have that on now. I got like a few people to literally go buy this. This is my new favorite. That was it for today's video. I'm actually gonna link everything down below on my bio so that you guys, if you guys do like any of these things, you guys can just click the link and buy them. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give me a thumbs up if you did like this video. And I will see you guys next time.